when the nation was founded and those documents were put together, the overwhelming influence came from that biblical mm-hmm. worldview. You know, it's it's unimaginable to me today. Can, imagine if we had a constitutional convention, we're going to redraft the Constitution. And we made it so overwhelmingly, the people contributing to it came from oh, so overwhelmingly from a biblical worldview, or God forbid we actually ask a pastor to come participate. They'd be screaming separation of church and state. Right. right. And I mean, just from what you shared already, it's, it's abundantly clear that they had no intention of the church being separate from the values no. of the state or the practice of the state. To your point, the vast majority, not not all of them, I would argue, were Christian, but the vast majority were. Of the 56 signers of the Declaration, at the time of the signing, 55 of them were attending Orthodox churches. 